am the quirky art nerd. I'm the preppy rich boy. I'm the edgy kid. All right, we're all here, but Danny, why didn't you send us back to middle school? My name is Dustin Learn. That was quite the entrance, but are you the teacher today? Think of me as your teacher, father, mother, and elder statesman. But yes, I am your teacher. Daniel, don't you think he sounds like Justin Stern? Don't we all sound the same? I don't know, but yellow paint looks really good on my skin. Is it black like my heart and my soul? No, green is the best color. It's the color of money. No, yellow, because it reminds me of sunshine and flowers and the sky and a rainbow. The middle of a rainbow. Welcome to middle school. <laughs> okay, today you'll be competing in different school subjects and the most outstanding student for each subject will win a star. Um, I don't see my name up there. I'm Winnie. Okay, Winnie. Let's see. Winnie. Winnie. Oh, there you are. Art nerd. <laughs> Good one. <gasps> I'm not a nerd, I'm just artistic, and I love myself. Each subject will have a winner. The most outstanding student wins a star. A star? That's so first grade. Yeah, I can buy stars. Okay, it's time for first period. Stay where you are, the art teacher will be here shortly. Art, I love art! I art all day. Okay, he's gone. Daniel, are you sure that this is the location where the proton packs are at? I think so. We looked on Evelyn's camera roll and it said, find him. He knows where the proton packs are. Yeah, but that teacher is Scoob. What? No, it's Sly Gold. No, that is definitely Justin Stern. Remember when we were sent back to first grade? And speaking of that, last time I was here, I snuck into his office and found the Candyman's outfit. So maybe I need to go inside of his office. You guys know that Evelyn is planning something on Saturday and we need to get those proton packs so we can trap her and her evil ghost brother. Say Maddie. And get our gender reveal. <gasps> That's the bell. Class is getting ready to start. Get back in your seat. Zane fam, make sure that you subscribe, have notifications on, and give this video a thumbs up before the art teacher gets inside this classroom. Hello, friends. My name is Mr. Pastel, and today we're gonna paint our emotions. Yeah. <laughs> Are you okay, nerdy girl? I'm sorry, I'm just tapping into my emotion. I'm gonna hand out some art supplies and get started whenever you're ready. Hey man, the art is happening here. Do you want to be a part of it? Uh, or do you want to fall like the bird out of the egg from the song? Is that a threat? Sorry man, but if you leave, I'm gonna have to send you to detention on Saturday. Bummer! Can I get more paint? He's he's coming back right okay, now. Okay, sorry. Back. Go drink it. You can put art wherever you want, but it's not toxic. <laughs> I don't want it. Okay, everyone, you have two minutes. Now's the time to tap into your emotions and express yourself. Ah! I'm gonna be drawing a rainbow and incorporating as many colors as I can for my art project so I can win the star. I am going to be painting everything in the color green because that is the color of money and that's what I relate to most. I didn't get black, my favorite color, so I'm trying to make black my art. Hey Zam fam, I am almost done, but first, glitter! Everything's better with glitter, right? Add some stars so I can win this. Oh! Sprinkle me now, sparkle me later. It's so beautiful. Hey nerd, after this, do you wanna go like on a date or something like that? I have a bunch of money. Oh, sorry about that. What? What did you say? I don't know, I'm gonna pay somebody to come and clean this up. Bye bye. There's somebody here? Okay, everyone, time to judge your paintings. I made a change, I listened to you, I really tapped into all the emotions that are going on in my head, and this is the representation of my emotions. It's pretty good. What is that? It's just all of them colliding and hitting each other in the face. Wow, I love how you expressed yourself, but it is a little troubling, so I think we're gonna send you to the counselor. Is there like a sh girl with blonde hair just kinda hanging around, she likes computers and stuff? I, I don't know, man. No? Well, what did you do, young man? Well, obviously, money makes the world go around. It's all in green, because that's the color of money as well. But I went a step further. I want to really tap into my emotions. So I, I put up here, first you have to get money to get, like, more trees so that you can make more money, you know? No! You're stuck on money! Oh! I don't like to use this word, but you failed. I failed! Okay, I'll, I'll buy my way back. I'll talk to Dad. And what did you do, young lady? Spark! is what makes the world go round. And I see sparkles everywhere, inside, outside, up there, down there on the floor, and in his face, because I accidentally yeah, sneezed. You got me pretty good, but we're going on a date later. I'm buying it. This is incredible. This is what I was trying to tell everyone about. Let your heart soar. Like, like a unicorn on an eagle soaring in the sky on top of a dragon. Hey, uh, to the point. You win. I win a star. What good does a star do? Damn, damn. 
Stick with it, come on. Okay. Artsy girl, you want a star. But what is that six for? The six is for... Oh, it's time for your next teacher. Peace, everyone, and love. What's our next class? Your next class is geography. You guys, do you see? There's a six on that star. What does that mean? What do we it do It must that? be a code for something. That was a code for the program the last time we yes. went set back to first grade. You know what? I bet you it's a code to tell us where the gender reveal is. Or a code for where Maddie is. You guys, or for the proton packs. That's why we're here in the first place, you know right? We need to get that so we can finally trap Evelyn once and for all. But where are we going to put a number? What does that even mean? Matt, where did you find that kitty minion outfit last time? It's right around the corner. It's in the teacher's office. Maybe one of us needs to seek away during geography class. You saw, I tried to do that. I'll, I'll try again. We need to get in there because if it's not there, I think that three-digit code might have something to do with the proton pack. The bell, the bell. Back to the seats. Who do you think's gonna be the geography teacher? Hello! My name is Stritten Stern. Now it's quiz time. Meet me in the back of the room. On your feet? Yes. Should we go now or wait till she's like, oh, I'll meet her tonight. <laughs> I'll meet you back there. I'll... How about I just buy my way out of this one so we... Ah! Young man, go to the back. Like that old maid right now, old lady. No, oh, no. What? Art is for the silly. No. No, I, I just drew peace, love, and flowers. <laughs> no. That kind of hurt. Okay, time for geography quiz. Up first, the edgy young man. Come on, show us the capitals of the countries. I hope you study. I didn't study. I hope you I don't study. Need to study. I don't need to study. Okay, this is my chance. Uh, just distract her. Distract? I, yeah, I'm gonna go sneak over to the office. What's the capital of Spain? Madrid. Very good. What's the capital of Australia? Melbourne. What is the capital of Finland? Helsinki. Can you give me a hard one, please? You know you're in middle school right now. You kind of know a lot for being in middle school. Oh, oh yeah. Oh, oh. Okay, smarty pants. What is the capital of Swift Maps? This is a trick question. That is like the brand of the map that you're using. Very good, young man. How do you know all of these capitals? My parents, they're traveling everywhere and they don't really communicate with me, so I kind of have to figure out where they're going and track them, so I just know. So wow. sad. So life is sad. Okay, found the teacher's office right now. Now I just need to go inside and get the proton packs or Maddie or whoever's in there. Hello. Okay, here we go. Locked. Oh, look at this. There's a keypad out here. They must have installed this. It's last time we got into this so easily. Now they, they don't need a lock. They need a keypad. So do the code. The stars, right? The stars might be the code to get in. Okay. You know, can't tell everybody. I know this class right now is geography lessons. So let me just write a note because that lady will never see this coming. I just sneak this note to Rebecca or Daniel to let them know what is going on. Okay. It's a keypad. This is going to foil our plans. We might have to stay in middle school a little bit longer. Up next, the flower girl. Hi, uh, Winnie. What is the capital of Brazil? Antaria. No! What is the capital of Canada? Does it really matter? Wait, what is this? Sydney? Yeah, Linda, what is this? Nothing, oh, What is this? Oh, sorry. Give me that, young man. No. Oh, yeah. You just no. I just dropped drop some money. Me Give me that note, young you. man. There's no notes in class. Oh. You failed! Failed you! Failure! No star for you! Shame oh. on your house! You failed for cheating! How does it feel to be a cheater? It hurts the face a little bit now. Yes, and you failed for not studying! What? I spend all my time on art and nature and beautiful things. You, young man, mm -hmm. you know your way around the map. Sure do. You win a gold star. Come, yeah, come I mean, with me. Fine. Cool. Come with me to the board. I'll get a star. Okay. Okay. We'll be right there to celebrate that yeah. star. Come with me to the board. What did you find? Okay, there's a keypad over there. There's the a keypad? Yes, I know. Okay, so those stars probably are the code for the keypad. Hello. Exactly, that's what that note said to Daniel, but she ripped it off. Okay, well, there's three names, which means it might be a three-digit code, right? That's exactly what I was thinking. Edgy kid, one star. One, one, the number one's on there, huh? Why? Why is there a number one and a six here? It's one because... Oh, that sound? It's time for your next teacher. What's the next class? <laughs> Whoa. Was no help. Hey, Daniel, what happened? Okay, I earned a one, but what do we do with these numbers? Okay, so six, one. Yes. Matt, tell them what you know. You're never gonna believe this thing. What? <gasps> okay, kids, my name is Mr. Runaton. Everyone get changed, it's time for PE. Let's go. Oh no, not middle school PE. 
<laughs> now it's time for red light, green light. When I'm facing away, that's a green light. But when I turn back, that's a red light. You better not keep moving or you'll be punished. <laughs> This is just like Squid Game! Yeah, but it's in middle school. And it's in real life. And remember, we need to win this game so we can get the last digit to get inside of that room. Wait, what room? What are you talking about? Oh, Dina. Yeah. yeah, I found a keypad. What? There is a keypad on that room where he found the Candy Minion outfit. Teacher's room. So that's where the, the numbers are? We think that's where the proton packs are, Zamfam. Do you guys think so? Okay, could be even Maddie. Maddie could be stuck in there. She could be trapped. Either okay. way, we need to get inside that room and figure out what it is. If it's not Maddie, those proton packs will at least let us defeat Evelyn so we can get Maddie back. Okay, let's I've played up. this game before. In Roblox, just don't move when he turns around. Okay, sounds easy. <laughs> Enough chitter chatter. Let's get started. Green light. Red light. I'm not even gonna listen to this guy. Oh, what are you gonna do, Squid Game? What? Oh, oh, he's chasing me. What? Oh, oh. green light. Hang in there, Daniel. Red light! If I move and I don't make it, then we won't get the last star and we won't be able to get into that room. Plus, Sam Fam, I'm pregnant. I can't get teased right now. Green light. <gasps> I did it. I did it. We did it. Oh, yeah, our girl won. And she won, and the stars and the trees were aligned. So we didn't get tased. Congratulations, art nerd. The last and final star. Six. 612. Well, thank you so much for letting us stay at class. I think we'll be heading out, right, boys? We should probably go. Class should be dismissed, right? Congratulations to the winner and to the losers. You guys lost. Okay, quick announcement. Due to budget cuts, the school dance will be held in here. You don't have time to change. Your chaperone will be in shortly. <laughs> we don't need a school dance. We don't need to... It's locked. That means we have to stay for a school dance. You guys, we already have the three digit code. We have no reason to be here. Guys? Oh no. Hey guys. Good news and bad news. Good Ugh. news is we have the three digit code. Bad news Ugh. is we're temporarily locked in here until the school dance starts. What? School we're dance? Locked in here? We're, there's a school dance. So we have to just do the school dance and then we can just get out of here, get the code, Use a three get the proton code. packs. Yes. Or Maddie or whatever's in there. No, okay. no, no, hold on, hold on, hold on. Another idea. You guys are the couple. You guys dance. Okay. I'll sneak out of the room and I'll go to that room and I'll use the three digit code. Hold on, Dan. Are you suggesting a distraction dance? Yes, distraction. You distract, I'll go sneak. I can't remember my middle school dance, and I definitely didn't know Matt when I was in middle school. Rebecca, we know how to dance, though. Yeah, but this is gonna be awkward. Who do you think the chaperone's gonna be? I don't know, but I hope this plan works, you guys. Welcome to the school dance. Your objective is to have fun. You better have fun. I will, because you said it like that. Go have some punch. Let's get it started with some upbeat tunes. Why are you moving me so much back and forth? What's going on? Sit down. And don't talk to your soulmate. Halloween hacker? Hey Maddie, didn't think I'd see you again. What's that supposed to mean, Halloween hacker? You're the reason that I'm trapped here. No, Maddie, you've gotta believe me. I stood up for you. I had no idea Candy Queen was planning to do that. I mean, look what she did to me. It's how I ended up here. No, before Evelyn took my phone, I was able to read some of the Zamfam comments and they said that it was Evelyn too. She made the plan with Candy Queen to trap you in that nightmare program. Really? I knew she didn't respect me much, but I didn't know she would do that to me. Thank you, Maddie. I needed to hear that. You've always had my back, Maddie. I owe you one. I've always got your back, Halloween hacker. All right, come on. With me, with me. Hey, hey, what about me? What are you going to do with me? A punch? Oh, uh, there's no punch in there. Nah, it's imaginary. There's no budget for the punch. If they were just to ask me, I could have bought the punch, obviously, and this whole dance. Oh, well, this is a cool experience, a middle school dance. Yeah, have you ever been to a dance before? I mean, it's a little awkward. Is this it's your first time? My first middle school dance, yeah. Do you wanna, um, do you wanna dance? What? I said, do you wanna dance? The music's a little, it's a little loud. I can't hear you. Wait, wait. Dance. Dan dance? Oh, oh, me. Yeah, like you, us? me. Yes. Like uh, the uh, rich. Uh, that wouldn't be awkward at all, right? The rich boy and the like artsy. Nerdy girl. Uh, no, just artsy. <laughs> nerdy girl, obviously. No. Yeah, <laughs> come on. Uh, You're so nerdy. Yeah, yeah, we, we can dance. Why did it got so hot in here, right? You know what? Let's get this dance going. Sam, here is the office. Here's the code. Okay, so it's six, one, two. 
I didn't do anything. Six, one, two. Pound? Nothing, okay, if three, let me just try a fourth digit. Six, one, two, four. Wait, that lit up is red. That means that we're missing a code number. It's a four digit code, not a three digit code. Oh no, I gotta go interrupt this dance and let them know. This is fucking, yeah, this we're is, crushing it. This is totally middle school. Okay, time to slow things down. Different song. It's like slowing down. I don't know to do with rhythm. Um, um, so. <laughs> what's taking Daniel so long? I don't know. I'm getting sweaty again. Yeah, Hold on, it's that turtleneck. Do you want to slow dance? What? I, I said, do you want to slow dance? Why, why did you change your voice when you said that? I just. Slow dance. You want to slow dance? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Uh, okay, yeah, I've seen this. So, like, so like I. I no, put in tight. No, it's like here. Uh, I think that's a little come weird on, for middle on. school. Yeah. I feel like middle school isn't isn't quite there. Oh, dang. Hey. 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 Slow dance. Slow dance. It. Oh. Hey. So, so uh, what's up? So that's the. It's a four-digit code. It's a four-digit code. Four, not three. So we need to find that last digit. Okay. Well, how are we supposed to find the last digit? Uh, I don't know. I. You know what? Just finish this dance. This might give us the last code. Okay. The last number. Okay. So. Okay. Yeah, slow dance. Good. Yeah. Come on. I mean, I don't know if this is slow dancing. Good. Yeah. Shake what your money maker. Uh, Shake your money maker. Come on. Uh, you're uh, getting a little. Okay, okay, okay. Too close. No, this is middle school. This is really awkward. Now that we're slow dancing like this, super yeah. close. Yeah, I know that part. We're okay. Uh, ever since I saw you earlier and you blew that glitter accidentally through a sneeze into my face, <laughs> I was like, whoa. And I took a moment and I was like, she could be the one. But you're a rich boy and I'm just an artsy nerd. You're a nerd, yeah. I'm glad that you're actually accepting that you're a nerd because super nerdy. I was like, wow, it's a nerd. You mean we're all just playing but, our part today, right? Yeah, yeah. But I was like, I could see myself buying that girl a lot of stuff. I don't really need anything. I'm good. And then I looked in your face and I was like, I want to maybe see if I can kiss that. This is so awkward. Yeah, so. So what? What are you doing? Middle Wait school. a minute. Mm. Wait, Wait a second. Oh, thank God. At all dances, you must remain six inches apart. Okay. I mean, that's not that far. Six inches, okay? okay. That's the theme of okay. the dance. It's the Honestly. six inch dance, yeah. okay? Yeah, it was Ugh, six. Six inch six. dance. Okay, six. Hey, give me a high six. Okay. Six. That was weird. I've never given it. I, I kind of liked wait, it. Wait, you feel that? Six. Daniel. Daniel. Okay. Maybe Daniel will give me a high six. There's no Daniel. punch in this. Punch. Daniel. Oh, what? The teacher. He said six. Okay. That must and be the last code. That's a cool thing. High six, man. No, no, Try. no. So listen. No, six. Six. Cool. six. No, no, six. Oh, six, yeah. one, two, six. Zampia, do you think that that's the four digit code? We just gotta get out of here. Let's get out of here. I think we've finished middle school. We've done enough today, and there's been a lot of awkward things. So... Hey, but what do we do about the teacher? Uh, Don't worry. Point. I got this. I'll meet you guys there. Okay. Okay. Hey, you measuring your six inch tie? Yeah. I feel bad about everything and lack of money here. So I talked to my dad. Well, I thought this would be a good time to give you some money. Whoa, is that $600? It's more than $600, but I'm also gonna ask you to just go over there and not turn around. So if I take this, I have to go over there and not turn around? Or just stay right here and not turn around, okay? Don't move anywhere. Just stay stern like that. It's Dustin Learn. Okay. All right, Sam fam, I hope this works. Comment below what you think is inside. Okay, six, one, two, six. <gasps> they unlocked. It worked, Sam fam. Whoa. Teacher's office? This is the teacher's office. I mean, there's just pencils and uh, scissors. Like, that's not anything. There's a printer. Okay. Oh, speakers again. Look at the speakers. You guys, <gasps> candy bending outfit. It's the same one that I saw last time. Do you Hold think on. he's working with the, with the candy queen? Look at this. Collect the proton packs and ghost trap and have them ready when you arrive Saturday for the ceremony. Evelyn won't know what hit her. CQ. CQ. Comment below if you know what CQ stands for, you guys. What are you, you, at, what are you what, pointing what, at, man? What are you pointing at? My shirt? You? I'm sorry. Yes, no, no, I had to look what. Not kiss me. Look oh. behind you. Oh, these are the proton packs, guys. Exactly. Zavam, do you think that this message means that the Candy Queen might be Trey Evelyn on Saturday? Definitely. Is, yes. These no are right. proton packs. That means that the Candy Queen is going to try to trap her. But if we take them, then the Candy Queen won't know what hit her. Exactly. Yes. And we can't trust that that's going to happen, so we have to do it ourselves. I only have two, though. Is that going to be enough? Look. There's more back there. Oh, there's two more. Two more. Great. Two more. There's four. Oh, there's one more than we need, right? Okay, let's get out of here with these proton packs so we can be ready for Saturday. Let's get out of here. Zavam, if you're seeing this, I need you to tell Rebecca Matt and Daniel that Evelyn hacked into my phone and they won't be able to use Daniel's phone to trap the ghost. They need to find another way by Saturday. You're not going anywhere until you eat this. Where are you going to take us? I'm taking you to the warehouse. What? No, you're not. Go, 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 go. 